Hey, welcome to Cool Car Therapy. Cool Car Therapy here. Today we're gonna be, be doing our very first Yu-Gi-Oh opening. We got two 20, Charlie, stop. We got two, Charlie, Charlie. This is very distracting. We got two tins, 2020s. I got some company today. Um, I got a buddy of mine who's actually going to be helping me opening up these tins. And let's see if we got something cool. He actually got me this really badass Slifer of the Sky Dragon uh, pop, 6 inch pop. This is really fucking cool. I love this thing. So he will be here. Charlie, we're going to get copyright strike now. Come on, man. You can't, you can't be putting, you can't be putting that music in the back. Alright, so I'll open one and, and my buddy will open the other one. So I'll start off and we'll go with this. His girlfriend and my wife are just looking at us like, oh my god. What, what did we what did we get ourselves into? What did we get ourselves into here? You guys will you guys are laughing now. Wait until we pay like all the bills with these cards, alright? Oh. <laughs> Easy money. Easy money. Alright. So if you haven't seen it yet, this is the 2020 tin. Really cool um, Egyptian hieroglyphics here. This is really nice. Um, let's open this up. It comes with three. It comes with three of these uh, 2020 tin of Lost Memories Mega Packs. Pretty cool. Let's put that aside. I honestly don't know like what's the most expensive cards in these sets, but I think um, you might know, right? I think it's the. Uh... Fusion Red Eyes Monster, what's the name? Don't act like you don't know. You know, know. you know, bro. No, I don't. <laughs> uh, we can look that up, though. <laughs> and that's why we got the internet. All right, so I'm gonna start this off. Wish me luck, wish me luck. Jelly Cannon, Hyper Psychic Riser, Galactic Spiral Dragon, <laughs> Marine Flesh Current. <laughs> Dark Factory of War Production. Valkyrie Chariot. Oh yeah. Are there hollows here? Yeah. Marincess Seahorse is a hollow. And we got Witchcrafter Creation. Ooh, this is nice. This is called Shaman of the Ten Years. Is that one good? I have no idea. Okay, it's so not on the high pride list. Of so it's so it's shit, is that what you're saying? Oh, look at this guy. This is a reprint of Orochi. Orochi, is this good? Yeah, you have that in your oh, manju deck. Sky. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you're right. I do have this. Oh, this is a yeah, nice you card. Manage the top eight cards Yo. to special summon them. This is nice. I want to put this back in my deck. I like it. And we got here Out Trigger Extension. Ooh, this is cool. There's a lot of hollows in these cards and in, in these packs. Chain Hole. Gladiator Beast, Flawless Perfection of the Tenny. I guess Tenny is like a new archetype. We're gonna get copyright strike here. Can't, can't be doing that. <laughs> Unchained Twins, Evil Eye of Gorgoneo, Nebula Dragon. Perfect dragon to add to a blue eye stack. Which one, this one? Yeah, Nebula. Whoa. Such a great special summon of an eight dragon, level eight dragon. Dude, I love the art on the Yu-Gi-Oh cards. They're so nice. Yeah. Like they really take their sweet time on these cards. I mean, All right, cool. cool. They did it full art. Full art cards would be amazing. I was just thinking about that, like having Yu-Gi-Oh full art cards. Bruh, right, bruh, Sly, Slifer. What? They're too nerdy. How dare you? I can't put all the writing on your <laughs> That's true. Yeah. <laughs> the full art would be just full of words. <laughs> exactly. You'd have to put the words on the back. <laughs> I mean, oh, too, hey, I that's mean, a good idea. I mean, sooner or later, it's going to be holograms. Dude. Gonna, the text is going to show up in front no, of you. But imagine, imagine. You have the title on top, the art is full, and then on the back, you have like a whole book of instructions on how to play. Because <laughs> look at, this is ridiculous. Look how many, this is like a paragraph. Who's going to... Who's gonna sit there and read that? I would, yeah, I definitely would. <laughs> Hold on, man. I need, I need 15 minutes to read this and then come up with a strategy. Make, make sure you put your glasses on before you can start reading. <laughs> All right, FA Shining Star GT. Damn, this is like Captain Falcon's car. It's pretty cool. Rogue of Endymion. 
Whoa. Alright. This is a Draco Masters of the Ten Yin. This looks pretty cool. <laughs> Thanks, bro. <laughs> nah, it's shit. I mean, if you use it in the nah, right deck. Nah, it's deck, shit, man. If you use it in the right deck, it's good. <laughs> Infinity, in Infinite Track Earth Slicer. Slicer, the Sky Dragon. <laughs> Ray's like, I'm out. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Strength in Unity. Oh, that's a good card. This is good? Oh, if you use a Blue Eyes or a uh, Dr. Griffin deck. Pretty good. Alright. Yeah, that's pretty one. cool. Oh. Oh, Ooh, aloof lupin. Babe, babe, look at this. Aloof lupin. It's a nice card. Look at it. So nice. Look at it. Nice. Take it. <laughs> don't act like you don't like it. I know you like it. I don't like it. Yes, you do. <laughs> You're gonna like. Oh, those other ones. They're big ones. Okay, I like it. They're big ones. Now, give it back. I'm gonna rip it up now because no. you hate it. Alright, last pack, and then we're gonna move on. To my buddy E. I'm gonna call him E. <laughs> He's so embarrassed. He's like, get me out of here. Dino Wrestler. Oh well is Trickstar Fusion. Dwimmer Glimmer. Okay, I'm not gonna try. Okay. Desert Locusts. Evil Eye. Repose. This looks pretty cool. Valkyrie Erda. Oh, Striker Dragon. Is that good? I think so. He is Striker. using a new Meta. meta? Link Dragon. Alright, I think I got a good hit here. Striker Dragon. Storm Dragon's Return. Valkyrie Sacheste. Hey, can, can you do me a favor? Can you, like, on your phone, look up Striker Dragon? Look at the price. Yo, three dollar card, yo. All right, cha-ching. All right, so these are my pulls. All right, now my buddy E will open his. Can you look at these cards? See, like, if any of them are worth like good money. I gotta pay bills, man. All right. All right, E. You're up. Hey, how's it going, guys? It's my first time being on the page. Thank you for having me. Let's look at this 10. I definitely like this 10 more than the gold sarcophagus because it has that. You like this one more? Yeah, I mean, know, it has. I mean, the only reason I like it has the tablet, like from the from the yeah. show, in the background, so. then the Millennium Puzzle more than the eye itself yeah like in the 2019 one yeah i agree i think this one is a better but i also like it because it's like um uh, how can you how would you say um like the claps all the class or whatever oh, like it's flushed? yeah oh, I see. so so like when you put it like i know no. not many people like it like don't like that Tins close like that, but I do because it's just convenient. Like you yeah. can sort your cards, and let's say if it falls down, it's not gonna open up easily. Yeah, so I, I like that part. I don't know why. It's waterproof too. Oh really? If you put cards in there, you're free. Interesting. Don't do that. Don't do that, don't do that guys. <laughs> Fooled me. Subscribe, like the video, help me out here. All I right, got so 32 we... subs on YouTube. I'm really happy about that. Let's make it up to 50 subs, guys. All right, so we got them three. Do a more collapse. Get that slicer in here more. I wonder what's the best card. Can you look up best card to get in 2020 It is the yeah. Red Eyes Dark Dragoon, which is market value at $40. Yo, Red Eyes Dark Dragoon, let's go. Let's get that. Let's put these aside Let's, for now. We, we, we got this. Let's see. We got this. E, we got this, bro. We got if, this. If we get it, Apple V's on me. Apple V, <laughs> GIX. <laughs> or maybe Chili's. Chili's is good. Chili's. Oh okay. <laughs> so we got Chili's Rise and Fire. Salam and Grape. Wolf. Wolf V? Wolf V. Uh, uh -huh. All right. We got World Legacy Guard Dragon Mardark. There's a Locust Gladi Gladiator Beast card. Another Tengi card. Nahata. Oh shit! 
We got a Burrow Load X Charge Dragon. Really yeah, uh, from what I've been hearing, that you can summon, let's see what it says. Uh, right here, requires two level Dark Dragon Monsters. And you can detach one to special summon a Boral monster from your graveyard. But banish it during the end, please. That looks really good. So if you have like, like, what's that, uh, Boral Sword Synchro monster in your graveyard, yeah. special summon him to negate shit. Mm -hmm. In case our opponents, but oh, that's cool. this one's a pretty good card in my opinion. It's like a fucking Voltron. Bro. Yeah, we got cool. Evil Eye Repose. Repo! Oh, we got a witchcraft, witchcraft card here. Oh, I've seen her. I think she's a. She's actually a pretty good card. I think. Yeah, like in the spellcaster deck, she's good. All witch, all witchcraft cards are pretty good from what I've heard, and especially in the dark magician deck with the. What's that card? Soul servants. I'm not sure. That's pretty good. Oh shit, we got witchcrafter, golem aurorison in this beast. Supposedly, let's see what she does. Yo, I think E got some good cards, man. Says you can yeah. special summon this monster whenever your opponent targets or attacks a spellcast type monster. Oh shit, now I guess we turn back to him. Nice. A free special summon. And then we got Link Mail Archfiend. Don't worry, buddy. We'll find the we'll find the red eyes. Don't worry about it. The Hiati the Fire Chamber. Gladiator Beast United. Man. Another Gladiator Beast. I like this one, man. I think this is a good pull. Which, which one? Which, which craft are you, Adele? Adele. Let's pull that we got a, bad baby up. We got Adele, the singer. Alright. Look, All right. she's really cool. Marine Sea Princess Sea Star. Come on, you have to appreciate Tangy the Tangy Spirit Tana. Really Let's put these to the side and open up another these one. Cards are Really cool. I love the hollow on these cards. Yeah. It's different from the old ones. Now they do yeah, everything they hollow. Do like, yeah. Like the background and everything. <clears throat> it's not like the those dual terminal that makes everything hollow but then star foiled on the Yeah, the old school cards, sometimes you can barely tell it's hollow. Yeah. Any any good hits over there? We got Domino Chamber of the Unchained. Subterra Succession, <laughs> Galactical Spiral Dragon, Marine Says Sea Angel, Apple of Enlightenment. Never heard of this card, I don't feel like reading it. Then we got Nightmare Incarnation Adeli, a level 9 fairy type monster. Hopefully, it does something. Yeah, the and then we got Waiting of the Unchained Souls. What's this? What's this? I have no idea. It says right here. If you link summon an unchained link monster, you can target one card on the field and destroy it. If the set card is destroyed by a card's effect, you can special summon one unchained monster from your deck. You can use the effect of Waiting Unchained Souls once per turn. I don't know. No, I'm saying, are you reading the card through the phone? Yeah. Bro. I actually was able to read it <laughs> through the camera, not the phone. <laughs> now we got Crackdown. Crack what the hell's that? That looks cool. Activated by targeting one face-up monster your opponent controls. Take control of that monster. While you control that monster, you cannot attack or activate its effects. What is this? Like uh, a change of hearts, bring control type of thing, but as a trap card? That's, that looks pretty cool. Yeah. This is pretty spicy, y'all. We got Salaman Great. Pyro, the Phoenix, pretty, a, card. pretty cool card, man. Ooh. We get Infinite Trek Fortress Pyro. Mega Clops, 4,000 level 3, 4,000 attack power level 3. Damn, what the? Three XYZ monsters. Yeah, but okay, stick cool. to summon. It's a lot to summon, I mean. Danger feats of strength. What's that? Alright, I need a hundred dollar card to make up for this purchase. <laughs> <laughs> Counting on you. Alright, we have one last pack to open All right. up. Hopefully we get, Can we get that it? red eyes. The Charizard. Charizard? <laughs> this is Yu-Gi-Oh, not Pokemon. It's Charizard, bro. Alright, fine. We can do it. We'll get that Charizard. I believe me. Get the Charizard. 
Gotta be the very best. Everything's trash, is that what you're saying? Um, yes. <laughs> it's only yeah. unacceptable. Right, let's see. Unacceptable. Guard Dragon. Promenesis. It. it all rides on this last Jolly Jolly Cannon. No pressure. What? <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. This is not mine. No, no, no pressure, but we got this. Alright, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, oh my gosh, look at this bird. Tiny spirit. Whitefish salvage. Remote is worse. Yeah. Eh, not a good car in my opinion. Best Panther. Oh, that looks cool. Like for Gladiator Beast. Ooh, World Legacy Monstrosity. Yeah, this is a good card for level cool. nine monsters. I think it's special summon right away from the deck. What do we have here? We have. No, this is a Sir Silo Watcher of the Evil Eye. A level four dark fiend type monster. I don't know what. Evil eyes cards do, but they're all right, I guess. That's mine. That's mine. Um, at least we got I'm like Omni Dragon Brotar. It looks, Is that good? It, it's pretty good in uh, Dragon deck. Just special summon. I guess you can special summon from the from the deck as long as you discard one monster with the same type and attribute. So let's say if you have all dark type dragons in your deck and you want to special summon a level eight, level nine, straight from the deck, straight to the field to link. Exceed, Synchro, whatever. That's a pretty good card, I believe. So it might be used in the new uh, Link Dragons matter deck. I'm not sure. We have Cat Shell, Maw Dog, Gladiator Beast. Another Gladiator Beast. Oh, can't even pronounce that. Vessels for the Dragon Cycle. Bunch of ass cards. Yeah. Sliver! <laughs> 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 Alright y'all, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, let me know if you like these Yu-Gi-Oh openings. We're definitely going to do more of these. I have a huge Yu-Gi-Oh collection. And um, my buddy E here, we duel a lot. Um, he actually got me back into Yu-Gi-Oh um, last year. So, pretty cool that I have him here in this video helping me opening up some of these tunes. Alright, peace out.